Hey everybody, I want to make a quick video here today. Um, I found this website here this morning. It's a very good one called World Archaeology. I will leave some links below in case you want to check it out. But this is about a four month old article entitled Children's Tomb in the Valley of the Kings. And I know the picture is a little morbid, but I am just going to read. It says this, the remains of royal children and members of the royal entourage have been found in an unmarked tomb in the Valley of the Kings in Egypt. The tomb, KV-40, was only identifiable as a depression in the ground before excavations began, but the dig revealed five subterranean chambers filled with artifacts including textiles, wooden burial equipment, large number of pottery fragments, as well as the mummified remains of at least 50 adults and children. The tomb was badly damaged by fire caused by grave robbers' torches in the 19th and 20th centuries, but archaeologists from the University of Basel Kings Valley Project, led by Susan Bickle, were able to read the inscriptions painted in yellow and black on many of the storage jars. These revealed the names and titles of at least 30 individuals lying in the tomb, identifying them as family members of the pharaohs Tutmoses IV, and Amenhotep III, who ruled during the 18th dynasty and were buried nearby in the Valley of the Kings. So I thought that was very interesting that in this tomb they identified family members of Tutmosis IV and Amenhotep III, the same individuals who I believe are the Biblical Solomon and the Biblical Moses. I will leave links below in case you haven't checked out those videos. But um, the tomb of Tutmos IV was nearby, and I believe that was robbed almost immediately. These two pharaohs were of great importance to the ancient Egyptians, um, and probably why they were later used as models for the Old Testament heroes Moses and Solomon. But um, we know that Tutmosis IV tomb was robbed almost immediately because I believe a 19th dynasty pharaoh put inscriptions in Tutmosis' tomb saying that he actually did restorations because the tomb was uh, robbed and damaged. So that's how we know it was robbed immediately. So once again, I will leave links below for this website in case you're interested, World Archaeology. Um, I just thought that was interesting. The same two pharaohs, who I believe are the biblical Solomon and the biblical Moses, their family members were found in this tomb in the Valley of the Kings. Hope you thought this was interesting. You have a nice day.